Hi everyone, Alan here once again. Sorry, I'd no video the other day. Um, yeah, one thing I would like to say, major thing I'd like to say. Um, been having a look at the TV schedules of late, and uh, you know, I've been going through it, going through it, going through the schedules. Understand that Ofcom got 266 complaints about the Vicar of Dibley, which is good. Um, I'm glad that people complained, um, because just of late, the BBC has just been showing nothing but uh, stuff that it's only fit for the dustbin. Yeah, they are capable of doing better stuff. But uh, I'm sorry to say, but uh, so far, so far, um, the TV that we've been offered is not worth £157 pound a year. And basically, uh, I'm telling people to actually turn around and... Uh, you know, you know, it, it's absolute crap, absolute crap that we're being, uh, like, for the prices that we're paying, you know. And the thing, thing, one major thing is, it's about time they all, you know, it's about time some of them lost their jobs, really, because they're absolutely hopeless at what they're doing. Um, oh, oh, yeah, children in need, what a farce that, that is. Um, they rip, rip you off, the, the public, because, right, the first six million, the first six million, right, goes to their staff, goes to their staff to pay for children in need, you know, what, you know, there's another charity on I, that goes on our TV, and every single penny goes to their, their charities, and uh, yeah, you know, what do I think? Well, I think that's deceiving the public, really. You know, it's like going up, going up to going up to somebody and grabbing them from behind and taking the money off them. You know. It's that so despicable. Uh, um, a lot of the programming that uh, has been scheduled for the festive season, it's all crap. All crap. All repeats. And all that. Yeah. Um, I think it's about time. I think it's about time that the BBC went to a Netflix uh, subscription service. Um, you know, and if you don't want it, you don't want it. You know, go somewhere else. We'll go somewhere else. But, you know, being forced to pay £157 a year, well, that's absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And... The thing, the other thing I think should happen is, you should, it should only be targeted at BBC content, and this is why I think a subscription service would be, uh, would be, um, would be better. Hang on a minute, they already do have a subscription service, don't they? It's called BritBox. It's called BritBox. If everybody subscribed to BritBox instead, you know, it should give you the option, you know. Can I just, you know, BritBox, you know, stick all your stuff on, all your good stuff on there, you know. Because that's where it's all going to end up anyway. Um, a subscription service would be far better, far better, you know, and, uh, yeah, well, and like the majority of the TV this year has been absolute crap, I've been watching Netflix and uh, Roku TV, you know, they've got lots of repeat programs on there, 
uh, uh, stack unsolved mysteries and stuff like that. Um, yeah. So first things first, we'll do our Thunderbolt but, connection. But, uh, you know, so far, uh, the BBC have not really delivered anything. ITV is just as bad. This is why I've been uh, watching Netflix more. Uh, even that's going some a bit down the drain. Because uh, they haven't been getting any new films of late. Yeah. And it's absolutely white outside. Because it's been absolutely snowing. Um, yesterday, Blackburn Town Centre, it's absolutely horrendous. Absolutely horrendous. They had to shut the... Um, precinct for a while because there were too many people in there too many people inside the shopping area people want to shop people want to get out you know instead of being stuck in the houses you know so yeah that is what's happened um, oh by the way I've got another channel open, opening up very soon but it's what, but it's uh, what they call a backup channel. Also, I'd like to, like to thank all the YouTubers in the Blackpool area and other areas for doing their content for keeping us all entertained. You know, without them, you know, um, it would have all gone nuts by now. And. Uh, It'll give us a longer cable, so you know, we'll a cable I'm watching uh, uh, how to build a machine and all that sort of stuff. Oh, another thing is, uh, Google have been putting a putting a lot of uh, courses up. Comp minor, comp comp TIA, the Google way, and all that sort of stuff. Uh, you know, have a look at them. They can be quite interesting. If you're into that sort of thing, into techy stuff, yeah, I'm gonna bugger off now because I'm gonna uh, go and get something to eat. So, before I go, all the shout outs to the usual suspects Beyond the Edge, PT, uh, Visit Foul Coast, Walk on the Wild Side, and basically anybody who does a blog. Um, I'd like to especially hear from from bloggers in the Blackburn area, you know. Um, I've been going through some of the videos, and some of the videos are quite old. Uh, guys, if there's some bloggers out there from Blackburn, please, please, please update your stuff. Because, you know, um, let's, have, let's see some... Let's see some modern parts of Blackburn, you know, see what's changed and see what hasn't changed, you know, we could do with that. Well, I'm now going to bugger off and uh, I'm going to go three, two, one, click.